Good morning guys, it's Jared here from Tackle Tactics. This morning I'm out with Lauren and we're going to be throwing around the Easy Shrimp. It's been a lot of bait and uh, prawns getting pushed around my local estuary system. So I'm in hope for a couple of nice flathead today in the morning. We've got a run-in tide, it's dead low at the moment. So I'm going to fish along these mangroves to start off with. As the tide pushes in, I'm going to go hit some deeper stuff and hopefully find some bigger fish. So stay with us and hopefully we can get a fish or two. Not the, not the thready. Got the net. Flatty. Nice flatty, Lauren. Nice flathead. Ready? That's a good one, eh? There we go. That's the first flatty of the morning. Just flicking these little mud banks, mangrove edges. I'll get a quick measure on him. Well, I guess as he's close to 60, I'm gonna say 58. That's a cracking way to start the morning. Nice flatty. 60 on the dot. Because he gave me some curry at the end. Lauren with a cracker. How good is that? What do you reckon, Lauren? How long are you guessing? 60. Lauren's really guessing yeah. 60. On the uh, ITX 2500 with a fresh spool of 10 pound platypus braid. Scoffed the prawn. The prawn's going off this morning. There's a nice 
nice fight. He, he's going 59. Keep his tail straight. 59. Alright. Happy with that. <laughs> to cast really far forward now because they're a bit too far. Yeah. Oh, you know, you're talking about that 70. This is a big fish. This is a big flatty. Yeah, it is. Oh. Far out. This is a massive flatty. That's a thready. So these are a donkey flathead. Could be a Jew. I think this is a big flatty, eh? Oh, can you lift the electric, please? Oh, good, all good, all good, all good. It's gonna drift back. Oh, I don't know what this is. Spot lock again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, yes. Nice. Yes. Well, there we go. That's an absolutely beautiful jewfish caught on that prawn. They had a huge school come through, but that prawn is down the hatch. What a beautiful fish. We'll get a measure on him. He's probably around 68, 70 maybe. And we'll um, send him home. Look at that. The silver ghost. Very. I said there was heaps of prawns in the area. That's what they're feeding on. That's how you know they release well when they do that. You little ripper. That was on the 1000 ITX of 10 pound platypus braid. Handled it like a champ. He's cutting line, cutting water. It's only a little one, I think. That's right, I've got him. Look at that. Jeez, nothing left of that prawn. Down the hatch. Ooh, he's going nuts.
little flatty. Nah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I have the net. Oh, it's a Jew. Number two. Another Jew. It's a Jewy. Nice. There we go. There's a second Jew. Not as big as the last one, but any Jews are nice. Jew. Second Jew. See you later, mate. Well, what an awesome session Lauren and I just had here at our local estuary system, throwing around the three and a half inch easy shrimp. But before I head off, I'm gonna quickly run through the outfit that I was using today. So that's a 1000 Akuma ITX, spilled with 10 pound platypus braid. Now I've paired that up with a one to three kilo black mamba rod. Now from the 10 pound braid, we're running a 15 pound stealth fluorocarbon leader down to a quarter ounce jig head and the three and a half uh, inch easy shrimp. What an awesome morning it was. We caught that really nice dew, a couple of really nice flathead. So we're gonna head off now. Hopefully you learned a thing or two in this video and I'll catch you next time. Cheers.